we are at exercise number 4.2 question 13 physics show that this left hand side is equals to right hand side Karachi board first year mathematics we are on okay as you see here at both ends of the security there is determinant and that side is the determinant as well we have to prove that this left hand side is equals to this right hand side but we see that there is x square involving term y square as a square root term but at the left hand side there is no any squaring now we are taking left hand side and making these as a square and simplify our this determinant to make this one okay so we take left hand side and by using property we multiply row 1 by x row 2 by y row 3 by z so that we get x square y square z square i mean this r1 is row 1 row 1 by x so row 1 is multiply by x it becomes x square this one is x x this x is x square then y z multiplied by x becomes x y z row 2 by y row 2 by y this one will become y this y will become y square this z x will become x y z after arranging then by multiplying row 3 by z we get z z square x y and z but wherever we multiply any row or column we have to balance we have to balance this it means we multiply it x y z so we have to balance it x y z for this balancing we have to write outside this determinant in division x y z okay now x y z x y z x y z in column 3 x y z x y z x y z all the elements are same it means they can be taken as common so we are taking common x y z from column 3 after taking x y z from column 3 the column 3 will become 1 1 1 it means nothing is remaining so we write 1 1 1 outside the determinant x y z in denominator was already there so x y z can be cancelled with x y z so we cancel now we find x y z x square y square z square 1 1 1 as was in the right hand side in our question uh, sorry left hand side right hand side in the question this one but the order is not right here x y z at the first position means first column x square y square z square in the second column and 1 2 1 1 1 in the third column we need this x square y square z square at the last as indicated in the question x square y square z square so we exchange c2 with c3 exchange c2 with c3 we can exchange this is also a property for determinant so column 3 is replaced by column 2 column 3 is replaced by column 2 means column 3 is at the place of column 2 and column 2 is at the place of column 3 but as we do this a minus sign is put outside the determinant this is balance to exchange the columns 
we get x square y square z square at the last but in our question this 1 1 1 is at the beginning so exchange c1 with c2 column 1 with column 2 we shall find this column 2 can be written in place of column 1 in column 1 this column 1 can be written in, in column 2 this one but for doing so again a negative sign is written outside the determinant then minus minus plus the whole determinant as it is and we can see that this is our right hand side in the question so right hand side we have proved this and that's it